wildlife agent Bob Freer is taking a trip with a passenger not many people would want. He's heading out to release the alligator with the amputated leg. It's recovered well from its operation and is now strong enough to defend its own territory and hunt again. Freer wants to make sure he is released near to where he was rescued. Okay, here we are right where we found him. He's got his den back in there, his, uh, basically his alligator hole that he's made. Uh, the fact that he is missing a leg, <laughs> away, yes, isn't bothering him at all. As you can see, uh, if he gets a chance to catch some food or to bite somebody uh, molesting him, he, he, he's going to take it. Yeah, he's ready to go. If you take a look here, you can see how it's actually closed up and healed. Deep hole. It sure is deep mud here. Not only do you worry about alligators out here and the venomous snakes, but down in this mud, South Florida, actually all Florida is famous for our big snapping turtles. And I haven't yet been latched on by one, and I certainly don't want to. Okay, buddy, here you go. You're on your own now. And there he goes. He's under. He looked around, just like he recognized where he was, and started to crawl off into one of these waterways. Yeah, he's home, and I'm sure he'll be doing a good job of surviving out here. With its diverse animal population, life as a Miami animal agent brings unique challenges and rewards. With the alligator safely returned to the wild, Freer can head home and wait to see what the next call may be.